Lindsay Burke and I've been beekeeping almost all of my life. I started when I was 23 and I'm the president of our company which is Australian Honey Products and we have three brands under that, Cradle Mountain Honey, Taverners Boutique Brewery and Sheffield Honey Farm. We export to many Asian countries and other countries as well, but China, Korea, Japan, and 60% of all of that that we export goes to China. The free trade agreement is wonderful for us because it gives us uh, the stability. We know th that we're going to grow and it's enabled us to employ more people, more local people. And it's worked out very well for our business because we can train them to do the beekeeping as we like beekeeping to be done. What's this one doing here? We've already set this in, in motion. We have six trainee beekeepers at the moment. We're going to employ more. We're going to expand. We've got more machinery coming, more packing lines, and a beautiful premise is being built at the moment. It'll be finished in three months' time. The Chinese market is very important to our business because uh, we're establishing relationships with them, and we understand now that, that they really value our products. We and have almost on a weekly basis, delegations from China coming to visit us now in our own hometown here in Tasmania. And quite often they want to come into the rainforest and see the honey that's being produced. The free trade agreement with, with Asia is very good for our business because we know that we can expand. We know that we'll be able to put on more people and we know that we'll have to sell it in different ways, less bulk, and more packed product value adding, which is good for everybody because if you do that, you get suppliers making labels for you, supplying containers to put it in, and you employ a lot more people.